Everything is better here. Everything is better in the Philippines. All right, so this is the, what do you call it? Okoy. The okoy from yesterday that we got from the market. We never had this yet, so we're gonna try it right now. Yes, we are. And so, it's, it's yes. fish. No, well, yesterday I just looked it up. It's, um, well, I mean, maybe you put fish in there, but it says like, it's um, fried fritters made with oh, well, glutinous rice, batter, unshelled small shrimp. Cause I was like looking at it and I'm like, it looks like shrimp. Well, yeah, that's fish. Your mom said it was fish. It's fish. Okay. <laughs> well, let's try it. Let's see it. Cut okay. it out and we get a piece. And this is the sauce you put it in? It's So it's vinegar. I know that. Vinegar. Um, I th everything we use is like vinegar. You remember when I did the Filipino challenge and, um, and I ate all the Filipino food at home? Yeah. And yeah, it was something that was very vinegar. Oh, yeah, yeah, it yeah. It was diniguan. Diniguan. So it's not, it's fried, right? So we actually had to reheat this, but. It might not be as good reheated? Yeah. That's what I'm saying. All that like looks so weird. You try it first. Try it. Okay, I'll try it without it. And you can do your normal. It's good. It's good. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Daddy's turn. And if this is fish, you guys should know I'm not like a big fish eater at all. But I have been having like like the bangos. The bago bolo. Bangos. Huh? Bangos. Bangos. I have been having. Smoked bungo, bungalows. <laughs> like every morning at breakfast since we got here. So like, if you know me, you should be proud of me because I'm having like different stuff. And I'm about to have this right here. Let's try it out. It smells good. Mm. There's some vegetables in here. Oh, mm. uh, I think there's a bit of like sweet potato in here too. Mm, that's good. I like it. Yeah? I like it. Let me try it with some of the saucy sauce. Yeah, me too. Let's dip it in here. Dip it in bigger. But what's like these little strings I'm seeing on here? What's the little strings? It's the shrimp's antenna. Mmm. Because, yeah, you know, it like almost poked me a little bit. Yeah. And I feel like I'm about to have like, like uh, something I'm not supposed to have, like a shell or something. Mmm. <laughs> mmm. -hmm. I like it. I like it. So as we wait for our grab car, I just want to quickly say hello to all the Filipino people watching, all the people, Filipino people tuning in. And I want to let you know how much I love it here, how much I love this city. And the only thing I'm upset about, the only thing I'm upset about is the fact that I can't see all of it. I'm not here long enough. It's impossible. I get to see like like this much of no, it. like this much. Like, no, we get to see like this much. And that's upsetting because I want to see all of it. <laughs> Hope everyone's having a beautiful day. A positive day. A blessed day. I'm surprised we got a blessed day out of the kids because <laughs> they're a little tired right now. <laughs> a little hot. Noah's really out. But welcome back to the family. Welcome back to the vlog. I want to quickly shout out a comment from Pretty Nestful. How you guys should go visit Uptown Mall and BGC. Uh, it's close to Venice Grand Canal Mall. The vibes there will give you a different level, especially of, of the iconic 3D billboard. Enjoy your vacation. I think that's exactly what we're going to do. We're going to head back into BGC. Now, like me personally, I, I, I want to be like in authentic Manila. I want to go where it's crazy, like Metro Manila. I want to hang out with Makati and walk <laughs> around and, and see like, like just what locals are doing. But I found that to be like very difficult with the family and especially the stroller. Cause like even in Makati, we haven't been able to like walk around Makati at all because like crossing the street you got to go underground and there's stairs and there's escalators that don't even fit the stroller so that's been really difficult so today i think we're just going to head back into bgc where it seems a little more chill a little more calm and i think uh it's easier for us to walk around and uh see what's going on and hopefully get like a, a sit down lunch 
because we haven't had the chance to do that yet. <laughs> I've seen this a lot the last few days, people walking with umbrellas. I think we need an umbrella. Look, here's another one, talking with this purple umbrella right here. I think that's what we might need because it's hot out here. I mean, I like it. I enjoy it. Kids, not so much. It's real shiny right now. <laughs> so already you can see like how just big the sidewalks yeah. are. Like it's so, so, so different. different. So, so different. So big. They're <laughs> wide, yeah. Like this feels like more at home, like more North American, more Canadian. But like that's for me personally, like I was saying, that's that's not what I want to see. I want to see the craziness, you know. But like you and I are just gonna have to venture off. I, I would love that, but like that's another thing. I've I've wanted to hit like Club District and McCaddy, like since I've gotten here. But I'm so tired at night. Oh man, <laughs> I'm putting the kids to bed at night, and then. I'm like, oh, I'm going to stay up and watch something, whatever. I pass out. <laughs> Every single time. I'll like edit the vlog and I'm like, I got to go to bed, man. <laughs> I guess I'm just getting old. I don't know what it is. <laughs> but we're going right here. We're going over here to High Street. Bonifacio, Bonifacio. I don't know if I'm saying it right. High Street over here. And uh, we're going to check it out, see what's going on. And I think there's like that iconic 3D billboard somewhere. Um, I don't know if it's see it in the day or what but we'll figure it out so crossing the street here is a lot easier um, than where we're staying in Makati we can so, actually cross the street yeah exactly it's the like, other one or in Makati you have to like time your way when you need to go oh you you like you it, like risking you, your life every yeah. single time you cross the street if you hesitate oh that's it so <laughs> the car is turning and I'm seeing stroller access there's stroller access. They thought of it. They thought of everything. You do not see this in Makati in Manila. It was like impossible to roll the stroller around. My people from the Philippines who are watching. As I stroll through places like this, and I walk through Makati, and I walk through Manila, and the malls, I want to let you guys know that you have everything. Like, I see more here, and I think I said this yesterday, I see more here than in Toronto. You guys have everything. My cell phone is connected to 5G, high speed. You guys have everything. You're, it's better here than in Canada. You guys should know that. <laughs> I think you said it's 40, 40 hottest, today? Yeah, the hottest few months, the next few months. So when it's our summer, it gets really hot too, right? I mean, like not this hot, but like, <laughs> not like this. no. And like still, like our hot is like it's 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 uncomfortable. Like this is hot, but for me, like I'm still yeah. Good. Like you can't breathe. Yeah, you can't yes. breathe in our hot. Yeah, so here humid. even though it's really hot, I can breathe fine. Um, I'm just sticky. <laughs> All right. So we're we're gonna stop and eat in the Philippines. And we're an American bar and grill. We gotta, we gotta be real American <laughs> right now. We gotta, we gotta be real American right now. We're going inside now. Here's another reason I have to move to this side of the world. Because basketball games are on at a decent hour. Back home, they come on like really late and I can't stay up that late and I gotta go to bed so I never get to watch basketball. <laughs> so I gotta move to the Philippines. <laughs> Hi Rugrats, what's next? Yeah, what? Ice cream? It was good not be ice! <laughs> what you saying, Mommy? What you thinking? Yeah, I'm thinking ice cream's good for uh, that. You want to go back to that ice cream shop that we saw up there? Yeah, why not? Give them something different. Not yeah. Like, not like, you know, what they're used to do cute because Mommy wants to try it. Your Mommy wants to try it too? No, Mommy wants to try it. You want to try it? Oh, okay. Nova, you like the Philippines? Yeah? You want to move here? No way. No. <laughs> <laughs> that was a hard no. So, how's the ice cream? So good. Yeah. And did I see you guys just share or try each other's? Very nice. And I got myself some ube. 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 
Mm -hmm. uh, I'm gonna try some ube. I've had ube ice cream before, so it's not new to me, but I'm gonna try it here, right from the Philippines. Hey! Mm -hmm. I try it Mmm. Let's just go to Ube ice cream. So mommy and I just came to the conclusion that this high street, this where we are, BGC is so nice Hello. that it's nicer than Hello. Yorkville Hello. in Toronto. Yeah, I agree. And Yorkville in Toronto for anyone who doesn't know, is like Hello. the <laughs> is like the high end area in Toronto. Hello. Like we're all like the rich people are, and like there's nice restaurants. Like this is nicer. It's, it, well, first of all, it's way bigger. Yeah. And it's nicer. <laughs> Something else I noticed about the Philippines is like you guys have like motivational and like positive signs and billboards that you wear. Like I should have been taking more videos of that and I'll start to try but I've noticed several times that you guys have like positive sayings like just all over the stadium which is amazing. So I think this is the big 3D LED sign. That pretty desperate was telling us uh, in our comment section that we should check out in PGC. It, it doesn't look very 3D right now, and I'm assuming, and I'm assuming that's because maybe it's not night. Yeah, it's I don't hard know. To see. Maybe it's hard to see. At night, you can see. You actually, you can see it's a little 3D. You can see it there. You can see the effect. But something tells me at night it looks even crazier. You see how it's popping out a little bit? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You probably. I don't know if you can see it on camera. Okay, cool. cool. Here's another 3D. I think this, this one even looks more 3D right now. This one's popping out even more. This is the one we were looking at before. Actually, it looks more 3D if like up close too. Okay. Okay. Maybe it's just what's on Now, now I can see the 3D-ness. Now I can see the 3D-ness. Okay, yeah, another sign why I have to move to the Philippines. You see this car right here? This is a uh, Toyota Veloz. I just fell in love with it. We just took it back from BGC to Makati. And I love it. It's the first car I sat in for a long time. I'm like, I gotta get this car for my family. But the problem is, they don't have that model in Canada. It's only available in Asia. Everything is better here. Everything is better in the Philippines. <laughs> All right. Here's the situation, babe. I'm thinking that we're gonna have to just uh, move to the Philippines. <laughs> I, I, just, I just like it better here. I just went to the gym, like a local gym. Took a 20 minute walk and it was like amazing. I was with locals and I just felt like it at home. Oh. Street food everywhere, it was crazy, it was busy. I, I, I loved it, I loved, that. I loved the walk, <laughs> I loved the gym. It was great. We have to move so here. So you're sold. I'm sold. All right. Well, we better get that real estate. <laughs> well, yeah, we got to get the real estate. <laughs> oh, man. Are we going to go out tonight? What? Are we, are, we, are we hitting on Club District? What day is it today? I don't even know. Is it even open? I don't know. Yeah, it's Manila. I feel like Manila don't <laughs> stop, bro. I feel like Manila don't stop. Oh my goodness. Oh. Um, you know, if I had, I wish I had that energy to go out. I really, really want to hit Club District and see what it's like because I know it's just crazy. But if it doesn't happen, it doesn't happen. It's okay. I'm a, I'm a dad now. I got I to do the dad things. Right. Dad and the husband. Exactly. You know? We don't even do that at home. Like, at home. That was boring though. We've, we've I mean, done I know. all of it yeah. at home. You know, you it's know? different here, right? So, <laughs> yeah, it would be nice if we could check it out. Yeah. <laughs> Anyways, thanks for everybody for watching. If you haven't yet, make sure you hit that like button for us. Make sure you hit that subscribe button for us. Thank you to everybody who's been subscribing, who's watching, who's commenting. We're reading your comments. Yeah, we love those. Um, love if comments. we haven't responded, it's just because we've got a lot going on and we're going crazy. Um, but yeah, we're going to try to keep this thing rolling. As long as we have Wi-Fi, um, you'll see some vlogs. Yeah.
That's it. And we hope wherever you are, that you're safe. We hope at some point watching this video, put a smile on your face. <laughs> sending love from our family to yours. <laughs>